Inside of Data Tools Pro, you can select any object inside of your Salesforce.com instance so that you can organize and manage all of your objects. We're going to take this tabular representation of our selected objects and we're going to click Entity Diagram. Once these visuals have been drawn on screen, we've provided some additional features to make it a little easier to navigate and understand these relationships. The first thing that we do is we allow you to turn off user relationships because Salesforce.com out of the box has a created by, last modified, and a record owner, which can get a little bit busy visually. So we're going to turn that off, which makes the diagram a little cleaner. Additionally, while we're in this area, we allow you to toggle between the field names and the API names. Now, when we click on an individual node, you'll notice that in this case, we're looking at the account and the blue lines represent every object that is related to the account. Now, if we click on the lead, you'll notice that we display green lines representing foreign keys or foreign relationships to other objects. So the converted account, the converted contact, and the converted opportunity are all visually linked using the lines and we have one external relationship from in this case the campaign and certainly if you wanted to focus on only a handful of objects you could hit shift or control select those objects and only focus your energy on those entity relationships the other options that we have available to us in our toolbar first we can zoom out in this case, maybe we want to do a little rearranging to clean up the diagram for our purposes. And now with this layout, what I can do is collapse the ERD, which will remove the detailed records. So I get a very high level, pure object ERD. Now we can expand it again. And then the last feature we have here is the ability to export this ERD to different formats. So I can export it as a PNG, which is going to be an image or I can export a high quality SVG graphic, which will render this so I can distribute it and maintain the visual integrity. So now we're, we're actually looking at the SVG. The last feature is the ability to jump from any one of these objects into the detailed fields. So let's say I want to look at the account. I can click on this little blue icon and that will push me into the data dictionary so that I have access to individual fields. So that's it for now. We're excited for you to get your hands on it and are always looking for feedback how to make data, metadata, and metrics easier to manage in Salesforce.com.